Hello everyone, in this video we will understand how we can calculate the sample size with the help of sample size calculator. Generally we use the calculator for, for numerical calculations like addition, multiplication, division, subtraction. But in this video we will understand how we can use the sample size calculator for sample size calculation. We will follow the two simple steps. Here we are going to follow the two simple steps for the sample size calculator. First step is that go to the Google and type sample size calculator. If you type sample size calculator, then you will get such a type of the result. Go to the first link that is the calculator.net, sample size calculator, calculator.net. Click on this link. Once you click on the link, then this calculator.net, this will be open. Now this is the calculator.net, a calculator for sample size calculation. Here, lot of fields are there, confidence level, margin of error, population proportion and population size. Already in the previous video, we discussed what is a confidence level, what is a margin of error, population proportion. Here, for the calculation of the sample size, only put your population size. Here in the first example, I will put my population size as a 20,000. Suppose if you put 20,000 in the population size and if you click on this calculate, this green button, then immediately you will get your sample size. Now here your sample size is equal to 377. Let us take second example. Now here in the population size, instead of 20,000, I will put 4,000 as a population size and then we will see our result. Now look at the screen. In the calculator, suppose if you put population size as a 4,000 and if you click on this green calculator button, then your sample size is equal to 355, 351. The third example, if you take population size 10,000 in the calculator, and if you click on this calculator button, green button, then your sample size is equal to 370. Definitely this is the easiest way to calculate your sample size. With this note, I would like to end this video. Thank you for watching this video.